audio check one, two. Okay. Hi, everybody. Sticky Hamster here. It's 10 o'clock, and it is time for some seven days to die. In our last broadcast, stream, show, or whatever you'd like to call it, we obtained a mini bike. I've heard rumors of the mini bike disappearing, so hopefully our mini bike won't go bye bye on us. Because it'll be a mini bye bye bike. <laughs> Bad joke, I know. Get used to it, folks. I'm a gamer, not a comedian. And there's the mini bike, so we're gonna leave that thing parked kind of off to the side of the house. And uh kill some of these zombies right here. Let's not be impetuous with that trigger finger sticky. There we go. One putrid girl coming up. Let's go put some parts in the house. So our major goals tonight are to find a gasoline book and a desert and hopefully set a tool and die. Will and die. I want you to die, man. How are you doing? Touch my thing. Let's uh, go ahead and uh, throw some of this uh, lead and brass into here. Sir Laser! Hello! How are ya? Let's go ahead and take this. Uh, we got some fuel in this one. We'll put some uh, stuff in here. We're going to need to get some more wood here. So we're going to take these casino tokens, drop them in here. And this lead. Dropping the extra stuff off in here. I record my videos at the same time that I'm streaming, so right now we're recording. And what I'll do is, it's 5.28 in the evening, and so, uh, just to, so I keep myself uh, recording a certain way, I'm going to go ahead and cut this video off at approximately in the in-game morning, when the in-game morning hits, that's a good reminder. So the first video is going to have a weird duration, and then after that they'll all kind of be even. I'll put my fuel in here. Okay, I had to mention something to the family that when I was streaming there. Talking a wee bit, dude. I don't want that to be over the recording. And the reason why I've got all these glass jars are going to be going on a water run here in a little bit. Filling up inventory with water. And I got some water right here, which I'm going to be processing with goldenrod. Make golden routine. Goldenrod tea. Here's some more feathers. And I have an anvil here. I'm gonna make some buckshot. 
Do I have the paper? I better make sure I got the paper before I make the buckshot. There's 38 paper. Oh, we got plenty of paper here. We go to this. And I click on here. I click recipes. Click paper. Craft. Yeah, 218 paper. We're going to make some more shotgun shells. There's some more paper there. We look downstairs real quick, too. Anything to do with gunpowder or bullets, I want to move upstairs. This old shotgun, let me see if there's any good parts on it. Oh, we got a zombie outside. I don't see her yet. Always have to kill these screamers as quickly as possible. There she is. She's down. Yeah, you leave her alone, she'll scream a bunch of times and summon a horde, and I do not want to have to deal with that. Whew. The guy is hot and complaining about the heat, so I'm going to. take off his coat, at least. Get some more brass to add to my flame here. What can I remove to cool him down a bit? He's got a coat on. We'll take the coat. That will cool him down a little bit. Kill this zombie. Oh, it's super early in the morning again, so we got the whole day to deal with. I want to get 45 of them. Need three more. Uh, maybe three stacks of tea. <laughs> Gotta put our bullets away upstairs too. We're, get, we're, get, we're gonna be moving everything from that box downstairs to upstairs eventually. Because I can make upstairs a lot more secure than downstairs. I will carry those shotgun shells though. Is there any brass here for me to mount? Okay. Put this into the... No, we're going to carry those. And... Um... Okay. Brass going in here. I'm grabbing bottles out. And buckshot, I can make plenty of it. So, whatever the maximum is, I'll make it. There, we got enough for 100 so far. I'm gonna give us another 100 shotgun shells once we combine it with our other stuff. Now, I don't need to carry that. I'm gonna grab some water. We're gonna make tea. Oh wow, this thing is so full. We're gonna have to let this finish its own. And we'll turn this off. Split the wood in half. Grab three stacks of water off of here. And then turn this puppy back on. Cook this in the other one. And uh, looks like we got some biofuel ready to go. So we turn this on. 
Uh, click the golden rod, click recipes, click golden rod T. And we got a little biofuel here. And this goes. Once we get the gasoline book, we're going to be able to combine alcohol with biofuel to make gasoline. Fortunately, we don't have that book yet, and that is something I desperately need. Um, I need to also do some cooking. I'm going to make some uh, meat stew. Gunpowder. There's some right there. Got the paper. We get the buckshot. Okay. I need to get some wood. I'll take it off one of these other uh, plants here. Pop that on there. Turn on. Up to Tina. Make that buckshot. And throw this water in here. We need to make another. Okay, uh. Walnuts went down a little bit because my character is so hot. Let me go ahead and, uh. Part, part of the reason why he's hot is he's standing right next to this forge. So, to cool him down even further, I'm going to put on the shades and the bandana. I'm going to have him take off some of his other clothing. Anything that heats him up a bit. Yeah, that heats him up, the, the mining helmet. We're going to switch to the Iron Hull, which will actually cool him down a little bit. Um, unfortunately, I can't wear the shades and the and down at the same time. But the Mining Hull is the same amount of negative insulation, isn't it? Yeah, so let's wear the Mining Helmet. Forget the other things. It takes too many slots. The shirt, that's plus insulation. Take that off the Iron Gloves. Those cool us down a little bit. Legs cool us down. And the pants cool us down. The pants heat us up. But the iron boots and the iron leg armor, those cool us down. So that combination of stuff cools us down. I will take my other things here for now. And I'll put them on this line here. Coat. Shirt. Pants. Shades. And down. I have a repair kit that I want to repair here in a second, but I definitely want to repair my shotgun, so go ahead and get these repair kits out for this. Repairing mining helmet. I'm not currently processing anything in this forge, so I'm going to turn it off. I do need to take these anvils here and place them into the forges that don't have anvils, just for convenience. My buckshot should be done soon. Okay, I hear a zombie, so we go deal with her. Okay. Now, if I could just walk past these things without touching them. There we go. There's my nail gun. Did I grab some woodlock spikes? Yes, good. Okay, now we're gonna go around part of the house and we're gonna put up some more woodlock spikes and we're gonna reinforce them with scrap metal.
And of course, lumber. Another zombie? Okay, I'm gonna go deal with this one. To me. Okay, we do have a few zombies over here. I saw. So it looks like we're gonna be combat for a bit. What's weird is a whole bunch of went in that house. But we do have a, a little bit of a horde to deal with. I'll take a painkiller. have anything on them. This. New coat. A brand new coat! I have no idea how many zombies are in that house, but it sounds like a lot, doesn't it? mind that feather. Listening for zombie sound. Hmm, there's not another one. Oh, doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Let's see anything here? No. I'll throw that on the ground so eventually it'll respawn. Okay, now there are zombies over the house. I do hear a little bit of crashing sounds. I don't know if those are... I'll take this chance real quick to search this stuff. We'll come back later and more thoroughly go over things. Okay, let's get this nail gun out. Only 31 metal left, so it goes quick, unfortunately. Put some more ones up here. We'll get more metal later. I can at least reinforce them with uh, regular wood, which is better than nothing.
Now we're gonna go make some shotgun shells. My dude made his little sigh. He's he's still hot. He's thirsty too. I'm gonna get you a beverage. Hold on. There you go. away. Bullet casings. Glad we're thrown into the fire. They get absorbed into the forge. And Another secure storage container. Craft it up. Put on the wall. All pretty. And this animal fat process. Bob Easel. There's 87 more of it. I just need to carry one stack for me. The rest I can. The alcohol one. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and make some corn mash. I hear another zombie. Let's go deal with it. Okay, dealt with. I want to replant this golden rod here. Also do some corn mash as well. Okay, seeds. Recipe seeds. Let's do about uh, twenty. That'll give me more than twenty seeds, of course. seeds there. Pepper the whole field up where we have empty spots.
it looks like some of our coffee plants got destroyed. So I'm going to plant some more, maybe have like several sections and spread them out. Some more of this stuff upstairs. I'm ready to make my buckshot. Sawed off, that's a sawed off shotgun. We'll put that one away. So, we'll go over here to this forge, grab this buckshot. Over here to shotgun. Oh, I do that outside the forge. Oops. Recipes, shotgun shell, and craft. Good. Okay, that'll do its thing. Got something is going up just by making that stuff. Good. Got some more animal fat here that we're gonna make into biodiesel. Get this tea out of this one. I need to have some green alpha on me. We're gonna get to the corn here in a second. This is doing its thing. It'll take a while. We need to add some more wood to this one. Now we're going to get some corn. I like to go along the top of all the stalks, get the top off since the top has three. Because if you accidentally hit the bottom part, the top part will fall to the ground and you lose it. So, and then after I've got all the little tops off of them, then I'll come back and get the bottoms. The bottoms are only one.
And I got all the bottoms, so I can just quickly spam this. thing about uh, corn, you don't have to till the ground. You can just put it wherever the ground is empty. You don't have to worry about spreading it apart or anything like that. Just plant it. Easiest food source in the game. Well, that screamer summoned a horde. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, let's see how many we can loot. We can get anything good off of these. Oh, the bodies go bye bye. Lead. here. Food. I'll wrench schematic. I already got it. Reading it for the experience. Okay. They're clear. And that's why I got to get a bunch more metal back here to protect this stuff. One little screamer causes all that trouble. Pick this up. Okay. Nighttime's coming. Okay, I want to go put away some stuff so I have room to loot. We're going to probably stay outside and hunt zombies tonight. I'll just stay on the move and try not to get killed. I got 148 shotgun rounds. I got plenty of bolts. I got a gumption to fight the zombies, man. Oh, we're going to pop this lead in here. Make some even more buckshot. Got some food there. Making more uh, cornmeal. Uh, some here. Uh, we're going to be getting our biology a lot of the fire too. Keep emptying that one every chance we get. 
got six more. Recipes. Bio fuel. Look it up. And we got 300 seed to plant. I am going to definitely put the corn half of it. Some of that corn's going in here. The rest of it we're making into uh, mash. Cornmeal for making. There. Good. We're going to be coming back with this. I got some feathers. Gonna need to make some more crossbow bolts. Got 142 on me right now. And we got some lead here. Buckshot. There we go. Where did I put that stuff? Must have been in this one. There we go. Gunpowder recipes. Shotgun shot. Okay, it's nighttime. Zombies will be moving quicker. Put away the gunpowder in the paper. And we are going to be actually fighting zombies at night out here. So you guys can see better in game. I'm going to wear this light. Wow. We got a horde on us. We got dogs too. Well, that was interesting. Screamer. Seal. I already have it. Hundred and seven shells left. Go throw stuff in the and we'll go out there and play Splatter the Zombie.
Oh, nice, some lead. More lead. That means buckshot to me. Paper's always good too. We clear? We clear for the moment? There's another crawler out here somewhere. There we go. And I love this game. We got one over to our left. Crawler. I'll let him take his sweet time while I go put stuff upstairs again. Bones are good. Bones are for glue mostly. Glue is used to make duct tape. And duct tape is one of your components for first aid kits. And somebody told me one of the reasons why I've been having trouble with my blood draw kits is blood draw kits are currently bugged and if you use them in your inventory instead of in your toolbar, they may break. So, somebody help me out there. Scrap of this. This to the fire. This to the fire. Cowboy hat I can throw away. So we're gonna get some of our Empty glass bottles. Right, let's be in this bottom one. Right, bucket. So we're gonna get some water here. Hey, Penny P3, how you doing? Hello to everybody else out there. some water on the ground. Hey, shadow team up. trip running cross country.
So now my guy's cold. First he's hot, now he's cold. Always complaining. Three more stacks for right now. We'll do these a little handful at a time so it's not too boring. But we do need to get lots of them because we're making uh, alcohol. Need lots of alcohol. Put this here. Yeah, it's repetitive, but if we don't do it like this. We gotta run literally like uh, over here on the map, like way over here for the closest water source. Annoyance. Now if I fill my entire inventory pretty much with water bottles, then it's better, but this is just better if I'm doing it like this. Okay. Now we're going to go take these over to almost uh, 4 o'clock in the morning, so time will be slowing down soon. We didn't have that bad of a night. We are going to do some mining during the day here. We need to get some uh, some metal to reinforce some spikes. Stone to throw into our forges to make some more concrete. Probably kill some Bambies on the way. Oh, there we go. Another zombie. It's like clockwork. I go up there, bam. Kill her fast, she'll come on a horde. Whoa. Alright. Wait. Okay. Here we go. And when the end game morning hits, I'm going to save the YouTube video. Stand up and take a very short break. Like two minutes, just enough to get the blood move around my legs. I recommend everybody do the same if you're if you're playing computer games for a long time. Just take a little breaks. You know your doctor will tell you to. I ain't your doctor. I don't play one on TV either. Uh, we're making alcohol. Making alcohol right there. Do I need to do something different? I got cornmeal. I got bottled water. What's wrong? Doesn't want to do anything. Here. I got the beaker. Beaker required right there. There, I'll do it in the other one. I'll probably have a beaker on this one too. Let's add some fuel to this fire. Turn it on. Like this. Recipes. Maybe because that other one's full. Something's weird. Grain alcohol. Beaker required. I got a beaker there. Oh, I have to clean the water first. It's Mickey water. Actually, it doesn't work because I'm using b bottled murky water. i got to clean the water at first. That was my mistake. So, bottled murky water. Go to recipes. Bottled water. That's what my problem was. This is dirty water. you got to use clean water. Yep, so, we're going to do that. We're all good now. So. That's what I was doing wrong. And let's go uh, take a real quick break right now. It's 4 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to start the next YouTube video, guys. And I promise you I'm going to be back in less than two minutes. Just going to stand up, move around real quick, and we'll get right back to our game. Thank you for watching. And please keep watching. The stream is far from over. I started at 10 uh, p.m., so I've been going for about an hour. We're going to probably go until, I don't know, maybe 8 or 9 in the morning my time. So we're going to have a nice long uh, stream, and I want you to stay with me all the way. Be right back, guys. Thank you for watching once again.